today i'm going to walk you guys through step by step how to create a tiktok ads manager account and be able to start creating your first campaign to start running ads making a tiktok ads account is really easy and it's very step by step on the platform but i just want to walk you guys through it in case there's any confusing parts or anything that you get stuck on so you know exactly what to do and you don't mess anything up so show you my screen over here there's a link in the description to go ahead and create a tiktok ads account that'll take you to this same home page and all you're going to do is click the get started button down here in the corner next you're going to enter your email address and password to go ahead and create an account with whatever email you want to use or you can connect this to a tiktok account although i do recommend starting fresh so as soon as you confirm your email and get your account created it's going to start taking you through the business setup page so on here you're basically going to connect your industry your business name and your phone number now if you're going to be using this tiktok ads account long term for different shopify stores or testing out different products you're going to want to make this section very very generalized just so they don't offer you any tips or offer you any home pages that you don't need so for my industry here, I'm gonna go ahead and select e-commerce. Now for your business name, you can put in whatever you want here. This isn't gonna affect what customers see or how your ads are ran. So I'm just gonna type in Zendrop ads. And your phone number, go ahead and type in a good phone number if TikTok has to send you any updates or alerts about your account. Accept that and go ahead for your state and go ahead and type in whatever state you live in. And now for your payment method, there's two different options you can choose from. There's either automatic payment or manual payment. So with automatic payment, it's gonna let you start running up a balance. And every time you hit about 50 to $100 in ad spend, it's gonna go ahead and charge that amount to your credit card on file. And it's gonna go ahead and keep recharging your account every time you go ahead and run a new campaign. And with manual payment, it's only gonna spend the money that's already loaded in your account. So you can go ahead and do a one-time payment of $100 and then your ads are gonna automatically stop running and be cut after that hundred dollar budget is spent so you have no way of getting over yourself or getting under the bus if you start running more ads and you're willing to spend but with automatic payment obviously this can go on indefinitely until your card declines i usually go with automatic payment unless i'm really trying to set a specific budget and i don't want my card to be charged so i'm going to go ahead and continue with my automatic payment and click go to my ads manager so now our tiktok ads account is set up and ready to go and it's going to go ahead and prompt us to create a new campaign here but i'm going to save this for the next video and go ahead and click on my dashboard up here on the top left now, once you get to your homepage on TikTok ads, it's going to give you a few steps to go in and get started. All you're going to have to do is set up your payment, connect a credit card, and then start creating your first ad whenever that's ready to run. Now, down here in your updates, it's going to go in and give you a few different things to learn about TikTok ads, what's new, what's going on, and things to remember. And this is pretty much everything you need to go in and start running TikTok ads. A few different tips for you guys once you're already running ads, you can go ahead and create new campaigns over here in the campaign tab, see what ads are currently running, see your budget, and see all your metrics. Over here in tools, you're gonna to be able to see your creative library where you can stock on other creators' ads, see what ads are performing, see what products are performing, and this is also able to be used as another product research method for drop shipping. There's also a TikTok native video editor that you can use if you're having to edit videos together or don't have a video editing software on your phone or computer. And in your analytics, obviously this is just gonna be reports of your ads, how they're performing, how many sales you're getting, and all that. This is also all able to be shown on your dashboard, but it's just gonna give you a more in-detail dimension on your analytics. That is pretty much all you guys need to know to go ahead and create a tiktok ads account as a beginner in the next video it's going to be going through how to create campaigns and what strategies i personally use to run my ads so if you're interested in that go ahead back to my channel and go ahead and check out that video whenever you're ready to start running your ads so you can follow it through now i hope this video helped you guys out if you had any questions on creating a tiktok ads account if you have any more questions or any other videos you'd like to see in the future don't hesitate to leave a comment below and i'll see you in the next video